is important because if you had this and this, yeah, maybe you have a lot of control. So I have to, I have to be aware. I know that he's on my neck, right? But I can circle and come over, right? Mm -hmm. He knows. He knows. He knows what's going to happen. Exactly. <laughs> so when you're here, oh, right? Exactly. Don't you know, create like you still be able to, you know, create like an arm bar, right? That's okay. Remember, don't look for perfection because you're not going to find it. Right? Especially when, you know, I could always think that like when you have a fight, it's going to look like the form. The form is the road, like the techniques and the principles. And then when all hell breaks loose, it's not going to look like that. It's going to look something like that. You know, there's going to be punches and kicks and throws and joint locks and stuff like that. But it's not going to be perfect. And actually, you know, at the beginning, you're not going to be, you're going to be super uncool. It's like the drone is going to be. That's why you're having a fight helps, right? Because getting that used to that adrenaline, and you get in the ring, and even though you know it's like, it's not a fight, it's, there's no knives, and like, you know, there's no lava on the floor, but it gets your heart rate going, right? That's competition, it gets you used to stress, right? And you also realize that, well, not everything happens perfectly, as long as you get hit, well, most of the time you get hit, like that, right? But you also learn, I get hit, I'm not gonna get knocked out like that, you know, like that, yes. every movement the guy walks up and throws one punch and knocks the guy out. All right. Now, like I said, when he comes reaching for me with one hand, we're important. I have this. All right. This is the uh, bridge hand. I'm, I'm, unlike a, you know, Perry or Watt, I'm coming up here. And I'm using this Fon Sabi. Literally, Fon Sabi is literally a turn over here. You can see my Fon is here. So, I have a couple options I can do here. One is, I'm already kind of pushing over this way. I have his wrist, and I'm kind of sliding the ground, and I'm going to hang around on the corner. And I'm going to reach and go on top of the other above his elbow. Right? And again, remember, I'm not taking it straight. I'm taking it to the angle. Right? So I'm going to take him, and I'm going to roll him arm over and out. Sorry, you right? Diagonal. If you came with the other hand, that went like this. Thumb, thumb, both thumbs are up, so it's like a baseball ring. Right? And I'm not going to take it straight in, right? I'm taking it at the angle. Just right foot. Right, right. Turn it over. Okay? I mean, this is, this is great, kind of like, you know, uh, law enforcement kind of stuff. Just get the arm here. Boom. Yeah, I mean, if you want to drive it flat down. <laughs> it works. Again, because I'm taking it to the 45. If I had gone straight, you might have been able to get out of that, right? Yep. And then it's going to kind of squeeze them out. I'm going to turn it in. Here. So we're going to take it like that. It doesn't matter. It's my knee is on your shoulder. Okay? This is going to work. Now, what's good about this is, right now, if you're under one of those jurisdictions where you're not allowed to put pressure on the body, I'm not going to put any pressure on the body. Here, here, breath. Here, here, breath. And you can, you know, walk it through. Okay? And again, remember, I'm not taking it straight, I'm taking it to the angle. Right? So I'm going to take him, and I'm going to roll the arm over and out. Sorry, right? Okay, so this is the elbow uh, diagonal form. If you came with the other hand, and I went like this, thumb, thumb, both thumbs are up, so it's like a baseball turn, right? And I'm not going to take it straight in, right? I'm taking it at that angle, which is right foot. Right? Turn them over. Okay, so I mean, this is, this is great, kind of like, you know, uh, law enforcement kind of stuff. You just get the arm here. Cool. Yeah, I mean, if you want to drag it just flat down, right? And then here, right? This is one of the police college techniques. You never have to say it out, but it works. 
I mean, yeah, because I'm taking it to the 45 feet. If I had gone straight, you might have been able to get out of that, right? And then it's going to kind of straighten out. I'm going to try to get it here. So you can see how you bend. It doesn't matter. Because my knee is on your shoulder. Okay? It's kind of worse than straight. Now, what's good about this is, right now, if you're under one of those jurisdictions where you're not allowed to put pressure on the body, I'm not putting any pressure on the body. You can get up. 